Hello everybody, it's Kara from Wild Book Garden, and today I am excited to announce the next round of book selections for the Not A Genre Book Club. I will link the announcement video down below um, if you want more information on this, but very briefly, the Not A Genre Book Club is something that I started recently, um, several months ago actually, and I've been thinking about it for a while. Basically the focus of the club is reading young adult and middle grade books and discussing them with the kind of depth um, and attention to detail and themes and character work and all of these things that you know often get discussed with adult books um, and with more literary books and with classics and not necessarily with um, kid lit as often. Which is not to say that that never happens but I think it's a little less common um, and middle grade and young adult books have just as much to offer as other kinds of books and so this is kind of meant to uh, give us a chance to read some of those and discuss them and hopefully it'll also help you if you are interested in getting into reading middle grade or young adult um, or maybe coming back to reading some of it but you're not really sure where to start. I'm hoping that this might be a good way to find some places to start. Um, and so our first kind of section of the book club was the Fairyland read-along. Um, at the time I'm filming this we still have our kind of wrap-up discussion but we have done the live shows um, for all of the books in the series. It was a wonderful way to start the book club. Thank you so much to My Name is Marines for being my co-host for that section. Um, I had an absolutely wonderful time reading that series for the first time, so I'm really glad that I finally got to it. I will link the playlist for our discussions in case you missed any of them. Um, and now I'm going to talk about the next few months. It's actually going to end up being basically our book club picks for the rest of the year. Um, so the first one is I am very excited to be joined by Olivia Savannah from Olivia's Catastrophe for one of my guests. Um, we're actually splitting up the two books that we're reading for scheduling reasons, but starting with a live show in mid-June, so coming up pretty quickly, although it is a short book, so hopefully you're still able to join in, uh, but we're going to be reading and discussing King and the Dragonflies by Case and Calendar, and that discussion is going to be on my channel. Um, it's a book I absolutely loved. It was one of my favorites the year I read it, um, so it is of course a reread for me, and Olivia Savannah has never read it before, and I think it's going to be a really really wonderful one to discuss um, and to really talk about, you know, some of these themes and characters and the really really important topics and ideas that middle grade books and young adult books can handle. Um, this one is specifically middle grade. So we're going to be having that live show um, approximately mid-June, um, and then in July, when I say that our, you know, July book pick is, I mean that th we're going to be reading it during that month and the live show will be either at the end of that month or the beginning of the next month. You guys know how it usually works. Um, so for July I'm being joined by my next guest, that is Hannah from Ball Gowns and Books. Um, you will remember her from the Frances Harding read-along and a bunch of other things that we've collaborated on before. In July and August we're doing a really fun pair of books. So July is going to be The Secret Garden by Frances Hodgson Burnett. Um, that one is also going to be hosted on my channel and this is a reread for both of us. Um, it's a novel I really love. It, it's a really like formative book for me, um, but there are definitely some issues with it and I'm really looking forward to discussing those with Hana and with you guys. Um, and then in August we're going to be reading A Bit of Earth by Karuna Vyazi, um, and that one is going to be run by Hana. Um, we're going to kind of do what we did with the Frances Harding read-along because Hana is a book blogger primarily. Um, her blog is Ball Gowns and Books, and so we're going to be hosting all of the videos that we do together on my channel, but she's going to be leading the discussion for her picks. Um, and so that one is going to be, as I said, A Bit of Earth, and we are both so excited for this. This is a, a secret garden retelling, like a modern retelling with um, an Asian main character, which is just something that me and Hana are both really excited for. We've been both anticipating this one for so long, so I can't wait for us to read it and discuss it with all of you guys. So that is our August pick. Then in September we're going to be reading Amber and Clay by Laura Amy Schlitz. Um, this is also a reread for me and I, once again, one of my favorite books the year I read it, I think it was actually number one. Um, this is a novel in verse and it is an absolute masterpiece and I think it's going to be a really really wonderful one to dig into and to discuss you know writing choices and characters and I feel like Hannah's going to really love it so I'm very much looking forward to getting to revisit it um, and discuss it. I'm going to be leading the discussion for this one. Then our October book and this live show is going to be probably mid-November for again schedule reasons um, but we are going back to Olivia Savannah and we are going to be reading The Knife of Never Letting Go by Patrick Ness. Um, this live show is going to be on Olivia Savannah's channel because it is her book pick and it's a reread for her. It's a series she loves. I have never read it. Um, I've had it kind of like on my radar for a really long time. 
um, and I've heard kind of varying things about it, but I am really excited to have an excuse to get to it because I've been wanting to try it. I've been so curious uh, to see how I will get on with it, so I'm glad that I finally have the perfect excuse. And then finally in November, um, Hannah is going to be leading a discussion for As Long As The Lemon Trees Grow by Zulfa Katu. Um, this is one of Hannah's favorite books and it's one that I have been so excited for and it's also Hannah's selection for me to read for my 12 books 12 friends challenge so a lot of things are just coming together perfectly um, I know this is gonna be really beautiful and emotional and heavy but also filled with a lot of hope and love and warmth and I just think it's gonna be absolutely incredible everything that Hannah has said about it has just confirmed my belief that I am also going to absolutely love this one um, so I'm really excited to be reading it Hannah will be rereading it and leading our discussion so hopefully that all made sense I will also type the schedule out in the description box um, because I know it's kind of hard to follow when I'm just kind of describing things um, but that is our plan of course things are subject to change as you know schedules change and things come up um, it happens to all of us so keep an eye on our social media accounts for any updates or changes um, and of course for when we actually settle on the date and time for the live shows but um, please comment down below let me know if you're going to be reading along with us I'm really excited for this lineup I'm so excited to have my guests Olivia Savannah and Hannah join me for some really wonderful discussions please comment down below and let me know uh, which of these you're most excited for or interested in or looking forward to um, maybe some of these are your favorites maybe you haven't read them before I'd love to hear any thoughts you have on our schedule thank you guys so much for watching I will see you soon with another video and I hope you love the next book you read bye